So you'll notice that there are students up there wearing stripes, a lot of this red and white kind of thing, right? Okay. Uh, those are uh, freshmen, sophomores, and juniors. The ones wearing the Bs tonight are the seniors, and we're going to be missing them. This is their last choral concert. For some of them, not their last performance, but their last choral concert. And so we're really going to miss uh, this group of seniors. By on Bonnie Banks and by on Bonnie Fate, where the sun shines bright on Loch Lomond, where the I first auditioned for choir at the end of my sophomore year, right as I was starting to think that music might be something I wanted to study after high school and maybe even pursue professionally. I could read sheet music, but I had never tried to sing from it before, so at the audition I was a deer in the headlights, completely bombed, did not make the callback list. I didn't feel like I'd given it my best shot yet, so I went into Shorty's office the next day and asked, can I have the music to work on in the meantime? come to callbacks anyway, and if I make it, I promise to just bust my butt over the summer and be ready for the fall. She had no reason to say yes, but she is who she is, so she just gave me a copy of You Are My Song and went, all right, get started. Fast forward nine years, music is my living, and I really don't think that would have happened if she hadn't just given me that chance. So thank you, Mrs. Short. Just want to say thank you for all the years of being a wonderful music teacher from first grade and music class and Willy Wonka in the fifth grade all the way to showstoppers in high school. It was such a blast. Congrats on your retirement. I would just like to thank you so much for really inspiring me to become the best musician that I possibly could be and to sing with all that I have. I remember even before I was a freshman at BHS, you invited me to come to a showstopper audition. 
it was my eighth grade year and I went to the audition and I watched the whole process and you even let me sing with the showstoppers and that was the second that I knew that I had to be in showstoppers I had to sing with you I had to sing with this choir to be able to just experience this amazing incredible talent and gift that you share with all of us every single day and Bellingham has decided to share a beautiful gift with you today as I film this video and I would just like to thank you so much for all the love and support you've given me and all the inspiration you've given me to pursue a career in music thank you so much just wanted to say thank you for being a mentor and a wonderful teacher during my three years in high school when I was in choir. I greatly appreciate how you took me in as a sophomore when I had had no singing experience whatsoever and you totally let me be a part of that community and it became my second family while I, while I was there. I've continued that love of singing through college and just thought I should let you know how much that meant to me. I moved to Bellingham right before freshman year, and even before I had entered the high school system, everyone told me you have to go to BHS if you like to sing. The show Shepherds will be the place for you. And I didn't know how right that was. From the moment I entered choir as a scared little freshman who didn't know anyone, I was so grateful for the family and home that you created for each and every one of us. Your leadership, your teaching, your talks, everything that you poured into this choir system really did change my life and give me a place to call home in Bellingham. I just wanted to say thank you so much for everything you did for me, for having confidence in me as a young performer before I could have it in myself. You were one of the first people to really help me in pushing my own boundaries when it came to performance and make me a much smarter and uh, more bold performer. Uh, to taking me from a kid who couldn't have known their vocal range if they tried to someone who has now just closed uh, the last few weekends of a singing role in an equity show here in Chicago. I could not have done it without you. Thank you so much. Thank you for everything you've done for me and the rest of your choir kids. From singing Boogie Woogie Bugle Boy in mixed choir freshman year up until winning state for the second year in a row, you've been supportive of me throughout my whole journey. I wouldn't be where I am today without you. Pelican High School is really losing someone special, but they were lucky to have you in the first place. Thank you for putting your heart and soul into the choir program. Being in choir and being in showstoppers were the most amazing experiences I had in high school and some of my favorite memories. So thank you for making it possible. I cannot begin to thank you enough for everything you've done for me over the years. You were my first music teacher in elementary school, and I remember so well that you advocated for me to play my flute in fifth grade strings because I was already committed to learning an instrument, and you could see how important that was to me. Not only are you an insanely talented choir director, but you also have such a gift for musical direction. When I was in fourth grade, my mom and I went to go watch Les Mis that you musically directed at BHS, and Watching that level of talent had me so inspired from a young age to continue learning from you.
the pure emotion that you bring out of people is something that I strive to bring out in myself every single day. I will forever cherish the many years of music education that you taught me to feel in the moment. From third grade recorder class to performing my final showstopper show, you have always been there, and I'm wishing you the best of luck in all of your new adventures. the most respect for you not only as a teacher but as a colleague and as a young man who grew up in your office with my dad in a desk next to you so uh take care stay in touch want to hear from you in the near future love you when i think back to high school my favorite memories are definitely in the choir room and competing with showstoppers. So I wanna thank you so much for those memories that I hold near and dear. You always pushed us to do our best work and you just cared so much for those groups and I feel so lucky to have been a part of it. So I hope your next years are filled with great company and great music because you deserve it. Miss Short, no teacher has influenced me or my life and its direction nearly as much as you did through my time in Bellingham and you you made a space for so many students to live joyfully, not just as themselves, but with one another. And I can't thank you enough, but all the same, thank you. wanted to say a big thank you for everything you've done for Bellingham and the music community and all the students growing up with your instruction and for the four years that I was lucky enough to work with you. Thank you for everything that you've given me in terms of my work ethic and I think just the innocence that some people can have in learning about hard work and really putting in the effort that you want to come out of a performance in music and all of that and it was really helpful to me in my developing years in high school freshman year senior year such a difference in the way i viewed music i wish you so much luck in the next stage of your life and thank you for dedicating so much time and energy thank you Miss Short, you absolutely transformed my high school experience. I came into BHS with a few friends, but didn't know very many people, and I immediately found community in the choir program. I don't know what I would have done without you. You honestly changed my life. I am now playing in a band that I never would have started without the skills that I learned from you. But more than anything else, I found an amazing group of friends who will last a lifetime. And that's all because of you. Thank you. Hi, Miss Short. Um, thank you so much for everything that you've done for me and for every single one of your kids to pass through the choir program at Bellingham. Um, you've had such a positive impact on my life and I don't think I'll ever be able to really thank you for everything you've done. Um, I hope this next chapter is everything that you want it to be. in Disneyland on the choir tour in 2018. I chaperoned and I got to see your qualities. You gave them such confidence in themselves. So then there's the music. Holy crap, Linda. What you did with those kids in music, I got to sit through the backstage Disney experience where a professional Disney music producer guided these kids through 45 minutes of recordings. It was just this magical moment of all the kids like bringing it. And he was like, oh, whoa, you're well-trained musicians. We're gonna have some fun here. 
It was amazing what you brought these kids to. Just fabulous, Linda. Thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Congratulations on your retirement. You know, this is one of those rare moments where we get to tell you just how impactful you've been in our lives and just let you know how much we love you and appreciate all the things that you've done. My two boys, Aiden and Colin Glaze, have really gained so much from you. Your support, your welcoming, your involvement, your encouragement, and acquired so many skills based on what you had to provide for them. Sitting and watching those kids perform has just been magical with all of the tours, with all of the solo and ensembles, all the opportunities and lessons that our kids have learned from you. It's been really outstanding. You're a very special person. I first got to know you as a teacher in the third, fourth, fifth grade talent shows. It was amazing to watch you encourage and support whatever talent they had. And then I watched your collaboration with Terry Grimes and was blown away at what you accomplished with high school kids. Forgive me all my trespasses and take me to your glory. And we got to collaborate on Willy Wonka and that was one of the highlights of my life. That was so much fun. And I think just the way you have taught kids and young adults the value of collaboration and what that means in their lives. And I want to thank you for that because that is carrying through the rest of their lives. Love you. To love another person is to see the face of Whoa!